everyone, welcome back and thank you for joining for this tutorial. As you may have noticed from the thumbnail, we have Cindy again today and actually this was recorded the same day as her glowing no makeup makeup look that I did a few weeks ago now. You can check out that video here and let me know what you think if you haven't seen it yet. Otherwise, stay tuned. Alright, so if you didn't see this look before, I'll put the link in the description box. Um, we did this glowy, more daytime, but you could wear it out too, look. And rustling of hair, I'll put the link to that video also. Now I'm going to show you just a quick way to take this from daytime to nighttime. So I'm going to take this pencil from Marc Jacobs, it's called Brownie. I'm basically just going to intensify everything a little bit. Just going to do a little bit of the pencil underneath too. Just diffuse that pencil along the lash line. And then I'm going to take this color from ours called Outer Limits. It's very shiny. I'm actually just going to use my finger. Using that same small brush from before. I'm going to go back and define the crease just a little bit with that brown color. This is a clean brush. Just a glow on the cheek we had before, I'm actually going to intensify it even a little bit more. So, this is cheeky bronze. do just a little bit of bronzer. This one's from Too Faced. It's 
しますからね。うん。感じる。何を言うてるんですか。I'm not going to use lip liner with that, but I am going to clean my edge up with a little bit of concealer. And then if you need to, just powder the center of the face one more time. Done. Russell's going to change the hair and then we'll be back to show you the final final hi it's russell here again and beautiful cindy she has a nighttime makeup look so and i'm gonna change her hair now coming from this like sexy upper lips Victoria's secret curls waves we're gonna do it uh we're gonna put it up in the bun in the high high bun. so i'm gonna show you how to do this i'm gonna use this rubber band Elastic. People use it for money too. It's just a rubber. And uh, I'm gonna show you how to like wrap it. Use it as your ponytail holder. Okay. But the first thing, um, I'm gonna gather her hair into a bun, and I'm not gonna do it really tight. I'm gonna have it soft and have some baby hair out. Make it look more like sexy, and a lot of the times you can do the ponytail even like with your fingers. It doesn't have to be like all clean brush. But I'm gonna brush. I'm just using uh, this. It's really soft. And as you can see, I don't have any products. I don't really need any products. So I brushed the whole thing, and now I'm just using my fingers just to get that soft. And after that, I just like soften around the face, have those cute baby hairs out. And what I do with this, I, I like to put a hairpin one side and then stuck it in and then just twist it like this yeah. put another one You can leave a cute pony, but I, I'd like to do a cute bun for this night look. Are you going somewhere to see me tonight? I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was now. <laughs> now I'm just teasing the base. That teasing uh, just helps to hold the shape. Now what I would like to do is just twist, ok? 
kind of create the shape. I like kind of longer shape, like really high bun. And I'm starting starting to put some hairpins right away. I know some people like like to finish it, put the ends down, then pin it. But um, I do like to start putting the hairpins right away, so you can hold the shape. That's it. Super easy to do. That's so cute. Alright, that's... That's it. <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs> <laughs>